in the backyard, sponsored by Custom Retaining Walls and Landscaping. Hi, this is Chad with Custom Retaining Walls for In the Backyard. This week we're going to talk about uh, installing bullet edgers around a tree or around the landscape of your house. The first thing you want to do when you're going to install bullet edgers is kind of establish your area you want to actually install the bullet edgers. Um, so what we did is we, we figured out it was 38 inches to the outside of this tree to give us a good radius around the tree. We marked that with spray paint uh, in a circle here and then we excavated down um, four inches in that circle to give us a good area and a, and a good flat area for the, for the bullets to actually sit around the tree. When you're doing bullet edgers, it's always a good uh, idea to actually excavate a little bit lower than the bullet, edger, bullet edgers are gonna sit. And then you can actually use some of the dirt you're excavating uh, as, as fines to, to set the bullets. Um, once you get that done, you can go ahead and start setting your bullets. When you set the bullets, it's really important to keep them flat and level. Otherwise you'll chip edges in the back ears here. And then you can use a dead blow or what we have here is just a setter to actually physically set the bullets into the dirt themselves, make them even, and then just work your way around the tree until you complete the circle all the way around. Once you have that done, you're gonna use dirt and fill in along the outside of the actual bullets themselves, level that out until it's even with the grade that was existing before Clean all your bullets off, and then it's time to mulch the inside. You can use mulch, you can use anything you want as your actual decorative mulch on the inside or, or decorative rock. If you're gonna do decorative rock, we'd recommend that you do uh, fabric on the inside. This is Chad with In the Backyard, and we'll see you next week.